people, Babsy here, right? I know it's been a while since you've seen me, but I have to come and talk to all you. I have to talk to all you. And don't mind the voice. Because, you know, I live in Toronto. I just lose my voice every time it get cold and thing out here, right? That's just how it is going to work with that here. Anyhow, I had to come and do an intervention because it's that time of year now where everybody gearing up to go down to Trinidad Carnival and thing. Don't mind that the airfare is high. All these people complaining, you can still see them down there, right? Them just talking. Don't mind them. Here I tell you, I can be down there too. When you see me down there though, ladies, don't forget the two second rule. When you hug me, tap, tap and let go. I don't want you to rub your pussy on my leg. I tall and your crutch can reach my my tie. Don't rub your crutch on my leg. I don't I don't like that there. You know that's what I mean. Anyhow, the intervention I have to come and do now is because a whole bunch of women this year talking about they meet man in Trinidad on TikTok and upon on Instagram and they're going to meet you for the first time at Trinidad Carnival. And when they show me pictures of these men and things, I said, no, wait, boy, I got to go say something. I got to make the intervention happen before this go down. Ladies, there is something that you might not know about Trinidad and Tobago. I'm going to tell you now. There are no single good-looking men in Trinidad and Tobago. I'm telling you that I ain't asking you. I know how it goes. You're going to say to me, Babsy, that's not mathematically possible. That's not logically possible. Trinidad don't work off logic and mathematics. Trinidad work off diesel and solar dynamics. You hear what I tell you? Listen to me. They may gotten a single good looking man in Trinidad. Not Raswell one. Not one. I know you're seeing the men and the, the dark skin and cut the hair low and they, 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 they shave off the beard and got baby face and they 50 and could pass for 20. And then you got some of them that like that mixed thing going on with a half Indian, half black. And they got that nice beard and then there's line it up and thing and it got nice little curly hair and thing. And then you got the ones that like, like Syrian and Portuguese and them mixing Chinese day and they just braid up the hair, man. But they look good and thing. Don't get tricked with no rascal trick. Trinidadian man, Trinidadian men ain't single. No good looking man in Trinidad is single, right? You probably telling me right now, but I asked them, Babs, if he had a girlfriend, and he tell me no. This is what I'm gonna teach you about Trinidadians now. He don't have a girlfriend. He got a wife, so he said no because he right. He ain't got a girlfriend. You might ask if he got a woman. He gonna tell you no. He ain't got a woman. He got a wife. You ain't ask if he got a wife, so he ain't gonna answer the question. Trinidadian men only answer the question asked. They don't volunteer no additional information. So if you ask if he dating and seeing somebody, no, he ain't dating and seeing nobody. He Rasso married. So he ain't lying. You understand? So be careful with that there. But what you really need to understand is the problem is not the men. The problem is the women in Trinidad. Because Trinidadian women do not date ugly men. They only date good looking men. That's the fact. You know how the rest of the Caribbean... People could be, woman could meet a man and she'd be like, he's not the best looking, but he's nice and think Trinidadian women don't play that. They don't play that. So, you know, you're watching like a pasta pasta video and you see a man and got big gold chain and thing and he fingers missing and he missing teeth and he big like Biggie Smalls and got champagne in his hand and then the camera does like pan cross and then you see his girlfriend and she look like Jamaica's next top model. She can stand up with he and party with he because he got money. Trinidadian women don't do that. Caribbean women they feel sorry for men and deal with men that ugly and not so good looking and thing. Trinidadian women chest too high for that. They don't date ugly men. They will take money from an ugly man. Right? But they make a stand up nowhere with an ugly man beside them. They ain't doing it. I telling you that. I telling you that. It ain't gonna happen. So know that even the ugliest women in Trinidad got a good looking man. So that's why there's a man shortage. That's why there's no good looking men that single because Trinidadian women want good looking men. So now this man you gone to meet, he got to find a way to get out of the house to come and get you and pick you up at the airport and play, 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 play Prince Charming, right? So he telling his wife that he, he, he co-worker cousins coming in from Toronto, coming in from New York and he got to pick him up at the airport. And she doesn't know he lying because the, the beat of no, the beat of sweat on his nose and the eyebrow raising and thinks she know he lying. So she got she eye on him now. And you don't know that. And he don't know that. Right? So then now, you're going back to your Airbnb with your friends and thing. And the man come in there. And then what happened next thing you know, you see a woman scale the wall. Climb through the window. Even though the window got bars on it. And come and kick off that window. And come in there and, and, and fuck up all you. Don't let this happen. 
And I know you're going to be like, Trinidadian women can scale wall. Let me tell you something. Trinidadian women is Spider-Man, Superman, Pokemon, and Shatterman all roll in one. I don't know if you see me post a clip back in the day and a woman is scaling a wall and fighting with a man and pelt. And listen, be careful with them Trinidadian women, you know. They ain't easy, you know. I tell him one of this for one of own good don't laugh, you know. I, I dead serious. She will climb through that window. It got bars on it and she can still get through there. You're going to want to know how the hell she get through that window. That's how them is. Now, if you're out in a fat and thing and whining with a man and you look around and you see a woman looking at you and got you side eyeing, watch yourself. She could be in a, a mini skirt, high heels, you know them fancy, bouncing hair, that Pantene Pro V hair that them got down there in Trinidad, all them. Even the black ones that ain't mixed with nothing got the Pantene Pro V hair too. Don't, don't get, don't get tied up. When you see that woman looking at you, you got both. 9.29 Russell seconds to move because she can break you saying bolt record for the 100 meters even though she got on a mini skirt and heels she run you to fuck down and when she come and beat that man you move out the way and don't say nothing to she you know do not say a word to her let her beat her man in public in, in peace you know Cause if you get involved you can get fuck up you know go and stand by the bar go and stand by the bar you're going to be the safest by the bar Cause Trinidadian women don't walk with guns. Trinidadian women don't walk with knives. But they will pick up something and swing it like Lara and hit you with it. So if you're by the bar, you can, can't get hit from so far. Right? Then now I tell you this already. Them just hit hard. Them women got right and left hand like Mike Tyson. I want to see your right hand. Knock the fuck out. And your front teeth lick out. And everybody can got them smartphone and be filming you on the ground. And if you didn't know this, I got a secret for you. You know, Ent Breaking News and Ebuzz TT. Me and them is friends, right? Them is my friends. Them is old whores like me. Them don't sleep. So if you get knocked to fuck out in effect in Trinidad, I'm telling you they can got your video on them page up before sun up. Ebuzz TT and Ent Breaking News. Them ain't easy. Them just get the fucking files, you know. Follow Soka can come late because she just rest. But these two here, Ebuzz TT and Ent Breaking News... Them gonna got you skin out before the sun come up. You hear what I tell you? Do not go down there and get broke up by nobody over nobody, man. Keep your eye out. Them women can run faster than you same boat and heels and thing. You understand? And do not judge a book by its cover down there. You can see some of these women and they small and they Indian and they look neat and king. They will Rajin Jim Jim Juma. You are a mother cunt. Rajin Jim Jim Juma. You hear what I tell you? So please, people. Let me go down to Trinidad, have a good time, and be safe, please. Because I don't want none of you to get break up because I can't come and stop in the fight. I'm telling you that from now. I ain't going down to Trinidad to go and fight for none of wanna. So please leave Golo man alone. Because I don't know if you know about Golo, but you're the hero. My uncle Sonny never ceased to amaze me. Yeah, keep away from Golo man. Golo gonna fuck up you. Like Russell. Here, I tell you. I gone. Later.